I bought this USB outlet off of Amazon and I'm going to install it. Before removing the old outlet, I need to make sure that the power is off. Find the breaker panel and turn off the breaker for your targeted receptacle. Bottom outlet's good. I always like to check the top outlet as well, just to be safe. Good, remove the receptacle cover plate held in by a flathead screw. You can also use a non-contact voltage tester. Remove the two screws holding in the receptacle, one on the bottom, one on the top. With the screws out, pull the receptacle out of the box. We're gonna unhook these wires. I'm gonna clean these up a little bit. I'm gonna strip the wire to 15 millimeter. There is a little strip gauge on the back of this outlet. It's kind of hard to see. I'm just gonna mark approximately where it's at. I'm gonna do the same for the green. And the same for the black. The gold is going to be your black on your right, if you're looking at it, and your neutral is going to be silver, and the green wire goes on the bottom to ground. We're gonna be installing this ground down. Insert the wire under the plate, just like that. These screws come all the way out already. Get it very snug, give it a tug, she ain't going nowhere. Push the outlet back into the wall. I try and get it as up and down as possible as this wire can be a little resistant sometimes. Line up one screw, couple turns, line up the bottom screw. Try and keep it centered. Check to make sure it's flush and tight and not wiggling. Next, I'm going to install the cover plate. It's labeled top, this side out, and it's got an arrow pointing down. This just slides right over, and it's held in by two screws. Here's the cover plate, labeled top. This just snaps on. I want to test both outlets. Looks good. Test all of your USB outlets. If they're all working, that's awesome. Hit that like button. Thank you so much for watching. See you on the next one.